Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the Genius Team channel or if you're new here, I'm Hassan Kasula. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of computers in our Introduction to Computer Basics video. Whether you're a tech enthusiast or someone just starting out, this video is for you. Let's jump right in. So, what exactly is a computer? A computer is an electronic device that processes data to perform various tasks. It's like a super smart assistant that can handle everything from crunching numbers to helping you binge watch your favorite shows. And it achieves this through a combination of hardware and software working together. The hardware includes things you can physically touch, like the CPU, RAM, storage, and peripherals. Software, on the other hand, is the set of instructions that tells the hardware what to do. Key Hardware Components Let's break it down. The CPU, Central Processing Unit, is the brain of the computer, handling all the calculations. Then we have RAM, Random Access Memory, which is like the computer's short-term memory, allowing it to quickly access information. Your secondary storage, whether it's a hard drive or SSD, is where all your files and programs are stored for the long haul. And for peripherals, we mean the input and output devices. Now, let's talk about how we interact with computers. Input devices, like your keyboard and mouse, allow you to give commands. And, of course, we have output devices like monitors, speakers and printers, which show you the results of your computer's hard work. The software magic. Can hardware alone make a computer truly powerful? And oh, it's the software that brings it to life. Your operating system, whether it's Windows, Mac OS, or Linux, manages the hardware resources. And applications, those are the programs you use every day, from word processors to games, turn your computer into a versatile tool for various tasks. Types of computers. Now, computers come in all shapes and sizes. There are beefy desktop computers for gaming or heavy-duty work, sleek laptops for when you're on the go, and even our trusty smartphones, which are essentially pocket-sized computers. Each type has its own strengths, but they all follow the same fundamental principles. And there you have it, a quick tour into the world of computers. We've covered the basics, but there's so much more to explore. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and if you have any questions or topics you'd like me to cover in future videos, leave a comment down below. In future videos, we'll explore more advanced topics, so make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out. I'm Hassan Kasula, signing off, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.